National Television Awards. From London's Royal Albert Hall, it's television's biggest night of the year. The waiting is over, as we're about to reveal tonight's winners. It's the viewer's choice. Who did you choose as your favorite performers? What programs will take the honors for most gripping drama and funniest comedy? Which soap will triumph tonight? We're about to find out the answers to those questions and more on the 11th Annual National Television Awards. For tonight's ceremony, McDonald, Sir Trevor McDonald. And should things fall through for Daniel Craig, I'm, I'm still available. <laughs> My assignment tonight is to host the 11th Annual National Television Awards, the only award show where the winners are selected by the people who know great television when they see it, the viewers. And once again... <laughs> thank you. And once again, you've chosen to accept your mission to take the thousands of hours of television and hundreds of performers and to narrow them down to just 13 favorites who will grace our stage this evening. Flying in tonight are stars who have come from Australia and from the United States to share in our celebration. This year we also have two exciting new awards. We'll find out about them later. So now to our first award, Most Popular Daytime Program. To present it... To present it, here's one of television's golden couples, not to mention the busiest. We're happy that they found the time to be here tonight. He is the popular presenter who created quite a stir on both sides of the Atlantic, and she has a career filled with sparkling success, hosting a variety of glitzy programs and currently bringing glamour to our screens every week, co-hosting the latest series of Strictly Come Dancing. Take your partners, please. Tess Daly and Vernon Kay. I'll tell you what, Mr Forsyth has got nothing to worry about. Two left feet there, Vern. Thank you very much. Thank you. There you go. Uh, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Sir Trevor, thank you for the lovely introduction. The nominations in the category of most popular daytime are... This morning... You are volunteering for another, another four years, are you? I'm volunteering, but yeah. that's up for the people to decide. We don't. We, we don't. Uh, <laughs> well, it's your birthday on it. May the sixth, so you may as well combine. You know the two. Yeah, and I will say if I don't know the date, no one else does. But you know, I don't know. It's a shame it's not May the fourth. Be marvelous. A great may slogan. May the fourth be with you. May the fourth be with you. Yes. See? You see, we're there already. <laughs> Is she all right? 
Well, we've, we've clearly lost the sound, but she's smiling, she's waving her arms. All vital functions are still intact. Oh, my goodness, Claire, are you all right? Hello, can you hear me? Oh, I can hear you. Oh, bravo. I, I have I'm to fine. say, heart stopping. Absolutely stop fine. I'm still here. As I said, Scotland will be fine and Northern Ireland wet down here, windy. Here's your summary. <laughs> Neighbours! You might find it hard to believe, but things have changed. I'm trying to bring them down. I want to reverse all of this, but I just need time. You are so full of it. It's all just words. I trusted you, and you rolled me. Here. Look, I don't want your money. Firmcom Australia's head office. Room 24, second drawer down in the desk. What's in there? I'll use that to find out. But nobody must know where you got that from, including Sky, is that understood? I never thought I'd see you scared. Yeah. It's not me I'm scared for. I'm finally the Paul O'Grady Show. Is that the one with Barbara Streisand? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, OK. Oh, well, we'll watch Meet the Fockers then. Definitely, I'll do that. And in it, um, the mums are, the mums are, um... Uh, um, a sex person. <laughs> she, um, she teaches sex moves for old people. She teaches. <laughs> she teaches what? Sex moves for old people. She teaches sex moves for old people. <laughs> I'll tell you what, things have changed since I was a kid. Tell me where's the uh, trophies in this relationship, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. And the National Television Award goes to. You got the biggest cheer, it's the Paul O'Grady Show. to say. I've only just sat down. I'm not prepared for this. So, well, I've got all the team of it. First of all, I'd really like to thank the viewers. They're the most important for voting for us. Thank you very, very, very much. And I'd like to thank all this shower here who appear with me regularly, who make the show what it is. All the team who work backstage, who have got all the ideas. I, I, I can't even think of anyone's names. <laughs> And I better haven't forget Bears, had I? And of course, the real star of the show can't be here because they don't let dogs in the Albers Hall. That's Buster. <laughs> but he sends his love. And I'd just like to say thank you very, very, very much for this. Thanks very much. See you soon. <laughs> thank you. Come on, gang. <laughs> And now the drama...